Well, 10 years ago, the story of a Florida State University graduate murdered in a botched sting made national headlines. As a result, the Florida legislature passed Rachel's Law, and it now requires law enforcement agencies to provide special training for officers who recruit confidential informants. Gail Guayardo joins us now with more. You know, it's been a long journey for Margie Wise of Safety Harbor, but this mom will always continue to fight to keep her daughter Rachel's memory alive. On the 10th anniversary of her death in harm's way, well, a short documentary about, about the Hoffman controversial the death citizen. of Rachel Hoffman was released. Hi, I'm Rachel. This is Ivy. I'm 10 years old. The film, directed by Florida State student Jackie Ortega, shines the spotlight on the 2008 case about a girl from the Bay Area who graduated from FSU, agreeing to go undercover for the Tallahassee police. The sting went terribly wrong. And they kidnapped her and they shot her five times and threw her a ditch in Perry. Margie Wise says her daughter was a star student who was pulled over for driving just eight miles over the speed limit with less than an ounce of pot in her possession. She believes her daughter should have never been an undercover recruit for Tallahassee's PD. Weiss was instrumental in getting the Florida legislature to pass Rachel's Law. And today, she runs the 501c3 Rachel Morningstar Foundation to educate others. I tell them, basically I tell them, say no if you're ever asked to work for law enforcement because it may cost you your life. It's dangerous. And in her daughter's memory, Margie is part of peaceful gatherings like the Purple Hatter's Ball that represents her sweet daughter's soul. And I think if we could establish a bridge between society that's being harmed and law enforcement that's trying to protect them and weed out those individuals who bend the rules or they have no rules to guide them, we'll have a much better world. If you would like to find out more about the Rachel Morningstar Foundation, just head to WFLA.com.